There goes Michigan. Bye-bye. And Ohio. See ya. From the Republican coalition that helped elect Donald Trump. It ain't going to continue in 2020 unless you end this trade war now. Donald Trump is the cause of some of GM's plight. They're closing plants in Michigan. They're closing plants in Ohio. Why? Cars, especially trucks, are made of big pieces of steel. And the price that GM now has to pay can't be passed on to consumers. It's a very competitive market for cars. It's got international competitors. GM is already fighting tooth and nail. And now your petty trade war. Petty because it's about power over China. It's not about true economics. True economics means you never have a trade war because trade wars have losers, both sides. China's not going to relent because China is run by oligarchs who actually gain power by thumbing their noses at the West. They're not politically hurting. In fact, it probably fuels President Xi's love or the people who bow down to him. The government of China right now is subsidizing its companies who see a higher price for their steel. Okay? They can withstand it. Sure, we can too, but why? Why not make the consumer king once again and stop playing to a few select industries? Republicans in Congress can stop this. You have control over international commerce at least as much as the president does. Okay? You've been circling the wagons for two years for everything Trump. And this is a bad policy. Trade wars are destined to hurt consumers. And now look, they're hurting industry too. Ms. Barrow was very diplomatic. She's the head of GM. Not citing the steel cost increase, but her trucks are made of big pieces of steel that inherently are causing her plants to be needing the closure. Okay? Ohio was on the verge of being a, a, a solidly red state. Now it's in jeopardy. Michigan, gone. You got to find some other states to feel good about re-election in 2020. How about making good, not just feeling good? Get us back to the free commerce that America can compete fine in. And if other countries want to dump and hurt their own people, we can withstand it fine. Let the American consumer again be king.